Well, hello, soul family, beautiful rising, good afternoon, and or lovely evening to you, wherever you are, depending on the location of your rotation. Mm. Thank you for stopping by my channel. This is our daily chakra energy readings, and today is Friday, funky fresh Friday, <laughs> April 26th of 2024. So, yeah, happy Friday to all of y'all. I hope you are all doing so very well. Um, yeah, all of my readings are intended to be timeless, meaning whatever you have found, this video is when you are meant to hear this message. So, use your intuition to tune into what that message is for you. All right, soul family, let's do one more shuffle and then cut our deck and check, tune into what our affirmation is for this uh, fantastic, funky, fresh Friday. Yep. So, okay, let's cut our deck. One for the money, two for the show, three to get ready, and four to go. All right. Okay, spirit, guides, shoppers, what affirmation do you have? for us today there we go so our etheric body is coming through for us today yeah auric field of the etheric body check out the healing symbol there you go card number five five is the number of change and it says all of the energies of the world around me only come to me to the extent that is tolerable for me and promotes my growth all of the energies of the world around me only come to me to the extent that is tolerable for me and promotes my growth. Yeah, all of the energies. Uh, oh, I like that because so the auric field, that is our, <clears throat> you know, it is the energetic field that surrounds us. So if we are, you know, working to strengthen that, then that means that any energies outside of ourselves are not able to reach us as easily as maybe they would if we were not consciously, you know, reinforcing our auric field. So I love that. All of the energies of the world around me only come to me to the extent that is tolerable for me and promotes my growth. So it's about only allowing energies that promote our growth and um, to the extent that is tolerable for ourselves. So there's no need for us to let anything through our energetic field that we cannot tolerate. <laughs> you know? So yeah, just uh, keep that keep that in mind, you know. So not everybody's energy should have the privilege of reaching you. Not everybody should have the privilege of affecting your mood. Not everybody should have the privilege. Actually, no one should have that privilege. That should just be all you. That is all your power. So, yes, it's about us keeping our power, not giving it away to anyone. So. Let's read the meaning. All of the energies of the world around me only come to me to the extent that is tolerable for me and promotes my growth. Meaning, when these healing words take effect within you, your reactions to the surrounding world will be less allergic in both the direct and the figurative sense. Then you will allow what you can actually digest to reach you instead of punishing yourself by taking on too much. Direct your attention toward the things, people, and situation that have a positive influence on you. Direct your attention towards what is positive within every human being to the divine light within him or her. Also do the same for yourself. Perceive yourself and how you are different from others on the basis of your talents and individual beauty. You can only develop the healing power to protect yourself from what is unbearable through your positive perception of yourself. Healing Stone, Jasper, Amulet Stone, Fragrance Essence, Chamomile, and the Bach Flower is Serato. 
so yeah i really do like that last line and it's how it says you can only develop the healing power to protect yourself from what is unbearable through your positive perception of yourself yes that part absolutely so this is about I mean, all of the videos, all like the whole reason why I even started this channel was to, you know, help whoever watches these videos, help them to, you know, tune into yourself and to help you, you know, to kind of just do the same thing that like I'm doing because I'm like, I'm on this journey too. So if these resonate with anyone else who's on this journey, um, then, you know, so be it or so not be it, whatever. But it's really about us changing the way that we perceive ourselves, us changing the ways that we talk to ourselves, treat ourselves and you know, yeah, just, it's about just reevaluating the way that we allow the world to interact with us and to see ourselves in the light that like we would see our best friend. So if you have a best friend and you're like, I do not want anything to happen to, I love that person so much. I would go to bat for them, and if you see anybody ever being rude to them, you are ready to step in and step, you know, stand up for them. That's what we should be doing for ourselves, first and foremost. We should be doing that for ourselves before we can do that for anyone else. And, like, whether you have, like, kids or, like, pets or whatever or, you know, we are the first person we are the first people that we should be standing up for so we should be standing up for ourselves the way that we would stand up for someone outside of ourselves that we love and care about so yeah absolutely so i uh, hope you all found something that you resonate with if this affirmation is resonating with you um and you feel like you want to work with it some more write it down i know it's a long one but still write it down it's a good r reminder to you know all of us that no energies outside of ourselves can ever reach us unless we allow them to so um it's a good time to reevaluate and see what is it or if we are allowing others to get to us, are we giving our power away to people outside of ourselves or situations outside of ourselves, et cetera, et cetera. And if we are, then like, this is our sign to reel it back in. So <laughs> yeah. Anyways. Uh, all right. Lovely soul family. Thank you so much for being here. If you found something you resonate with, then please remember to give the video a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel if you're not already. Uh, happy Funky Fresh Friday, and I will see you all in the next one.